weight's a problem and the ground's not too hard, you can use plastic netting pegs. They work. However, if the ground is too hard, you've got to make the decision. Carry heavy, cheap steel pegs or light, strong, expensive aluminium ones. The choice is yours, but plastic pegs do have a place in your kit inventory. They're a worthwhile, inexpensive alternative. If you have compatible sized bottles and a few simple hand tools such as some shears, a marker pen, a lightweight drill, some drill bits designed for wood and some bright cord then you can make a simple cheap effective water resistant container. Having cut one bottle we then cut the other to size. The bottles will fit inside each other. One problem however is if the bottles are sticky, your hands are wet, the bottles are wet or your hands are numb, it can be quite difficult to pull them apart, especially if you're in a rush. But there is a simple, cheap and easy answer. Using the marker, put a mark on two strong pieces of plastic on each bottle. Then using the 5mm wood drill, punch in a guide hole in each position. Once you've marked the holes, it's time to charge the drill with the bit and tighten it up. Put the drill into the guide hole and drill two holes in each end. Cut a piece of green cord, feed it through the holes and tie it off. You now have a sturdy container that's semi-waterproof and easy to open. To make the container a little bit more water resistant, you can put glue around the holes here. You can use these containers for a whole host of storage solutions. They're sturdy, they're waterproof, you can see what's inside and they're cheap. If you're in an open area like the moors, it's very difficult to find trees to use your shelter sheet. One answer is to use bivy poles. The quality of bivy poles ranges from issue to appalling. The big problem is the turn button catch. If the catch goes you can replace it with a bolt aided by a wing nut. In the field you can use an elastic band or two to provide a temporary passable solution. At home if you've got no bolts you can use a rolled up bicycle inner tube which is a bit more effective. So if you're going to buy equipment buy quality that will take the strain. Buy rubbish, buy twice.